Let's have a quick conversation about SeedFi. So SeedFi has a credit builder. And uh, in today's conversation, I want to really review their credit builder loan to see if this is something that you might be interested in. Because the bottom line is they're going to help you uh, improve your credit score. But the question is, are they the best in the industry? And do they do a good job? Okay. By the way, welcome back to the show. It's really a pleasure to have you here. In today's conversation, I want to talk about SeedFi, their credibility alone, and see the ins and outs. I want to see the pros and cons of this product to see if it's really worth your time and money. So here's an overview I really want you to pay attention to. So SeedFi offers personal loan and line of credit options for borrowers looking to build credit. So the bottom line is, if you are looking to build credit, you're trying to rebuild credit, you're, you are in a situation where you want to improve your credit you might be interested in seed fire product, okay? So whether you opt for one of its uh, borrow and grow loans or a credit builder prime line of credit, seed fire will report your payment to all three credit bureaus. This is kind of good. They're very consistent and they're very fast also in reporting your uh, credit uh, routine to the credit bureaus. I'm speaking here about TransUnion, Experian, and Equifax, okay? So both the borrow and grow loans and uh, the credit builder prime line of credit those involve a savings component which may be uh, really helpful if you have struggled to build an emergency fund in the past okay so what are the pros and cons of this product pros you may build your credit with uh, on-time payments this product helps you build a savings account and uh, does not charge interest on the line of credit they don't charge you any interest at all what about the cons here you cannot borrow more than $500 at a time through the line of credit. The product does not allow you to apply with the co-signer, so you are on your own. And they do charge interest on borrow and grow loans, okay? So this is what it is. It's just part of uh, part of the offer they have right now. So the bottom line is if you think about if you think about SeedFi, you have a certain amount of money that you can borrow, okay? It's not always uh, straightforward how much you can borrow because it really depends on uh, the state you're applying from. But basically, they are trying to help you actually build your credit with your own money, okay? So with SeedFi's, for example, it's, if it's SeedFi's borrow and grow plan, you have a win-win-win situation because you get some cash right away while also building up some savings for later. So borrow and grow growth plans actually... Uh, they give you uh, loans for the first time. If you if you are looking for a loan the first time around, yet the amount you get will depend on uh, your your credit history, also in your financial situation. So this is important to have a great habit and really stick to it. If you are going to work with SidFi to kind of help you uh, build your credit profile, but also improve your credit score, real real quick. Let's have a conversation about the target, the target here, okay? Who SeedFi is best for? Now, SeedFi credit building products could be right for you. If you are looking to build credit, let's say, you know, you 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 have been there, done that, something happened to you, a bankruptcy, collections, whatever, and your credit score, like, you know, nosedived. So right now you're sitting uh, at around 400 or 350 or 300 for that matter, okay? And this is kind of dire. So you're really looking to... Uh, looking for a way to come back up. So Seed5's products are designed specifically to help low or no credit build borrowers build credit. It will report your payments to all three credit bureaus on a monthly basis. Although Seed5 cannot guarantee that its account will improve your score, on-time payments make up a large portion of your credit score, right? 35%. That, that's, that's more than one-third. And as if you want assistance growing your savings, you could be a, a great ta great target for SeedFi because your payments go into a locked, no fee savings account with one of SeedFi's banking partners, Evolve Bank and Trust or Cross River Bank. If you decide you don't need to spend a full amount once it's available, you will have an emergency fund you can draw on in the future. So this is kind of cool. And uh, you are if you live in a participating state because SeedFi is not available everywhere. Right now, it operates in 36 states and Washington, D.C. Remember, in this country, banking is regulated at the state level. And so you need to have a banking license from the state authority. So, so far, SeedFi hasn't really uh, secured such a license from some states. OK, by the way, I want to quickly remind you of today's topic. We're having a conversation about SeedFi Credit Builder Loan Review. I'm just reviewing. I'm giving I'm giving you an in-depth review of this product. So you have a clear idea what it is about if you decide to go with them. 
So I just so I just explained to you who seed fire is best for. Who seed fire is not right for? Seed fire might not be the right fit for you if you if you can qualify for better rates and terms elsewhere. Seed fire's loans are specifically designed for borrowers with a low credit score or a thin credit history. If you have strong enough credit to get a better offer from a traditional lender, I think that it's just better for you to find prefer preferable rates and terms elsewhere. Here is the approach I really want you to pay attention to. So when we think about seed fire, how does everything work? Now, borrowing money is easiest if you already have a history with credit. Now, credit builder loans like the one offered by our online lender, SeedFi, are designed to help people establish credit so that you or they, everybody else, are more likely to qualify for a credit card or loan later on, okay? So, credit builder loans differ from other loans because you can get one without a credit history, but you don't receive the money up front. This is the, the particular, uh, the particular I would say, the particular feature in this loan, okay? You don't get the money up front. Instead, the money is kept in a savings account and you get access to after paying or ending the loan. And these loans can be especially helpful using uh, using like this technique for credit new credit newbies. Seed Fire offers a credit builder loan option in the majority of states, as I said before, 36. Okay. So other options for getting on the credit radar include getting a starter credit card that is relatively easy to qualify for, having someone with good credit adding you to their credit card as an authorized user, using money you have saved in a bank or credit, credit union account as a deposit for a loan. Having a loan or credit card in good standing can help you build credit more quickly. Okay. So this is how this whole thing works. Now, how Seedfire's credit builder loan works in, in specifics? Well, it's it's it basically the first of all you have to qualify at the state level, but basically you you can add, you sign up for a loan of credit, for example, right? I mean, you, you remember that you have the grow the, the loan part, you have the credit builder prime, which actually puts a long term savings spin on the traditional credit builder loan. So you sign up for a loan of credit in your name and can choose a payment as low as ten dollars every other week. Payments are timed to your paycheck on a cadence you can, you choose, okay? And you don't get access to the line of credit right away. Instead, you make advanced payments on the debt. Once your payments total $500, Seed5 moves the money to a savings account you can access. Credit Builder Prime is free, no fees or interest or charge, so you give back all the money you put in. And what makes this plan different from others, it, it's basically, it's revolving credit structure. So we are speaking here about a lot of credit, so it's revolving. So unlike the typical installment loan, your credit builder prime account remains open after the initial $500 and the cycle repeats. So it's all about rinse and repeats, rinse and repeat, okay? So you want to keep your payments going and get access to each, you get access each time to, uh, you know, $500 if you save that much. The savings account and the money in, in it are all yours. So while you're repaying the loan, the funds are locked and serve as collateral. Once you hit $500, the money is unlocked and the money is yours to use as you please. You can either continue saving $500 in increments while earning interest like a traditional savings account, right? Or you can choose to withdraw or transfer the funds up to six times a month once your account is unlocked. So this is kind of cool. So Seed Fire's credit builder plan can help can help your credit score because they will report your, your data to the credit bureaus. Okay, so overall, this is a win-win. It's a win-win for you. If you just stick to the plan, you got to stick to the plan, though, boss. You need to stick to the plan. Let me actually quickly review uh, the, the things we're talking about here. So when we speak about Seed5 Credit Builder Loan, let me talk about the details. So the maximum loan amount the, the loan is available in $500 increments because I really want you to get that $500 increments. The line of credit has a limit of $1,000. Okay. For the borrow. So that's for the credit builder prime for the borrow and grow. You have 4,000. Okay. What about the APR for the credit builder prime? There is no interest for the borrow and grow. The interest oscillates from 12.96% to 29.99%. Okay. For the loan term, it, the, the for credit builder prime it the, the things the term is flexible but you must make a payment at least once the first three months and at least once every six months after that what about the the borrowing grow it's between 10 and 48 months what about the payments well payments the for the credit builder prime ten dollars or more and for the borrowing grow that's the loan program payment every two weeks or twice a month monthly payments are double okay 
What about the credit requirements? Now, there is no credit requirement for the credit bid alone. And for the borrow and grow, they don't disclose that info, but it's, it should be the same thing. You don't need to have a specific credit to actually qualify, okay? So, boss, I want to quickly remind you once again of today's topic. We are speaking about Seed 5 Credit Builder Loan Review. I'm giving you, I'm going granular today to really give you all the things you need to, uh, to keep in mind before actually signing up for this service, okay? And when we talk about the Seed 5 Credit Builder Prime, remember, loan amounts, we're speaking about increments of $500. Okay, $500, this is important. So, for example, if you have paid back $700, you can access $500 now and, and an additional $500 once you pay $300 more to hit the $1,000 mark. So, the increment is always on the $500, like $500 increments, okay? And what, what about the cost? They don't charge you anything. For the borrow and grow, the, 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 you actually, the loan, will, will, the loan that you get will range from $300 to $4,000, okay? In the loan terms, we are speaking about repayment terms that range from 10 to 48 months, so 10 months to four years. And uh, everything will, de will depend on the loan amount, the, the repayment window will depend on your financial situation because C5 will actually analyze your financial profile and see what kind of uh, situation, what kind of, uh, I would say, what kind of uh, window, what kind of terms and conditions will be better for you, okay? And But in any way, shape, or form, Seed5 does not charge late like late payment fees either on the Seed5 Credit, Credit Builder Prime or on the, grow, on the Borrow and Grow, okay? And they don't charge also uh, prepayment fees. So no prepayment fees and no late payment fees. So it's, it's really a program that is meant to kind of help you out, like, you know, help you out to just regain some footing in terms of uh, in terms of your credit score okay and your, your FICO score let me talk about eligibility so basically how do you qualify for a C5 credit builder loan okay one thing you need to understand here is that when it comes to uh, when it comes to approval things depend on the state but things depend on, on your state, like the kind of criteria that Seed5 has put in place at your state level. So loan applications are approved or declined based on, on a number of factors, right? And all lenders have their own unique underwriting requirements, but this typically include information from your credit profile and other factors that demonstrate your ability to repay the loan, such as income, for example, and sometimes they pay attention to your DTI. They might actually look at the DTI standing for your debt to income ratio. They might Take a look at your CUR, your credit utilization ratio. So there is a, a variety of factors that the lender will actually pay attention to. Okay, so meeting the requirements below, meeting the requirements that I'm just going to give you, would not guarantee approval, but they can help you decide if a credit builder loan is the right opportunity for you. Okay, so in terms of credit score requirements, there is no minimum credit score requirements for Seed Five's Credit Builder Prime products. However, Seed Five does run a hard credit check when you select a borrow and grow loan offer it does not disclose the minimum credit score requirements for borrow and grow we, we have actually done a, done a little bit of research and we found that they will uh, the minimum they will accept is a four, 400 415 that's what they will accept okay what about income requirements so to qualify for a seed file loan or line of credit you must make at least ten thousand dollars in annual take home that's net income and have a bank account in the united states so ten thousand dollars in uh, annual take home income right so when you divide that by 12 you probably have uh, you have less than you have about 850 like 825 850 my math is not really good but i know for a fact that 9000 times uh times 12 that's like 10800 so if you if you go like 850 you should be about the right or 825 so if you make the minimum amount again i'm speaking about the net amount so after taxes okay what about co-signers and co-applicants? Now, Seed5 does not allow you to apply with a co-signer or a co-applicant at this time. So what they have done is that they really want to focus on you, okay? Not trying to really get help get help from a third party or a second party, whatever you want to call it, but just focus on you and really uh, get to the program and get whatever you need to get out of the program. This is what they're trying to focus on at this time. And what we have seen also is that Seed5 is trying to make sure that you apply right away, that you basically get the, the program that you need and uh, so get on with uh, with the program, so, so to speak. One thing I want to say here is that overall, when you think about this eligibility, those criteria are very, 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 uh, I would say uh, lenient. 
okay seed five really is trying to help you out here obviously they're not a charity they have to make money also but the way the program is set up i mean they're not the only one though but i just want to say the way the way the program is set up you basically are going to are going to save you are going to see results real fast as long as you stick to the plan as long as you stick to the to the program because you you have to speak you have to stick to the program part of it is uh, your responsibility and part of it is uh, seed five actually reporting your data to the three credit bureau so that you can actually uh, move up the ladder the fico ladder real fast Let's talk about the application here, okay? Let's have a conversation about the application. So, how do you apply for a Seed5 Credit Builder loan? Now, you can apply for a Seed5 account on the company's website. So, just go to the website and apply there. And basically, you will start by sharing some basic personal details and giving Seed5 permission to check your credit report and bank account. You got to have a bank account, though. This is important. If you have, uh, if you don't have a bank account, you're not going to qualify for this program. And so what will happen here is that seed file will show you which loan offers you qualify for a process that won't impact your credit at all. See, this is like a pre-qualification process. Okay. And if you see an offer you like, you can move forward with the full application. Seed file will set up one or two no fee savings account for you, depending on whether you choose an installment loan or a line of credit. So this is, uh, the, the way, the way your account is set up, uh, past the, uh, the initial phase will depend on the the choice you make and also the specifications in your state because maybe the product now is not available in your state or it is available okay so if you see an offer you like just make sure make sure that you choose that okay make sure you choose whatever that that's really uh that's uh, suitable to you along with meeting seed five's income requirements remember the income requirements ten thousand dollars net every single year you must also be eight, over 18 you need to have a social security number or individual tax identification number, ITIN, and a phone that receives SMS test messages. You got to have a phone. Now, what about customer reviews? When you think about now, reviews about the Seed Files program, especially the way you sign up, have been extremely positive, extremely. You know, we actually spoke to a lot of people and it has always been very, very positive. So as a matter of fact, Seed Files has an excellent rating on Trustpilot with over 3,000, as of the date of this show, 3,000 reviews giving it an average of 4.8 out of 5. So satisfied customers said the process of borrowing the seed file was fast, efficient, and easy. Some also said the company had excellent customer service representative who answered all the questions. So this is kind of cool to kind of have like a company that's really uh, dedicated to helping helping co consumers here. And overall, our interaction with the seed file was also positive. We, we didn't have the, like we, we didn't have any kind of, uh, you know, we, we, we did not try to, let's say build our credit but we just sort of investigated the the company a little bit asked questions around and it was always positive it was it was really positive all the time now let's talk about the rivals because seed is not the only player in this industry you have, you have other players and uh, so how does a seed credit builder loan stack up vis-a-vis -vis the others okay and i want to quickly uh, focus on two so we have the kickoff credit builder which we have reviewed on this show before and i want to review i want to really also look at the self credit builder and so seed five credit builder loan versus kick kickoff credit builder now similar to uh seed five kickoff offers a 750 dollars revolving line of credit designed to help you build credit in other words if you have if you if you have subpar if you have a, a subpar FICO score, you will love also the kickoff credit builder. Okay, so you will get access to the money right away, but you can only you can only spend it on items in the kickoff store, which start at ten dollars. Now, kickoff reports your monthly payments to two of the three credit bureaus and doesn't charge interest. However, you will need to pay a five dollar per month membership fee. You may also be able to borrow an installment loan, but you will need to qualify. So while Seed Five is available in thirty six states. Kickoff does operate in 48, so you can see there that the geographical, the geographic delta is uh, in Kickoff's favor. What about the Seed5 Credit Builder loan versus Self Credit Builder? Now, Self is another company that provides loans designed to help you build credit. So, if you borrow from Self, your loan proceeds are locked in a certificate of deposit until you pay them off in full over 12 to 24 months. 
And so basically the process is a little different, but uh, we're speaking about 12 to 24 months. So you got to have a little bit of patience here with, with self. And uh, with self, you can get a higher amount than Seedify offers up to uh, 1,663 back after fees, but the APRs are higher, typically starting between 15% and 16%. And self does report your payments to all three credit bureaus and they do operate in every state. So we're not speaking here about, you know, 36 or 48. We're talking about all the 50, including Alaska and Hawaii. So you have there the ge geographical, I would say, advantage that is very clear with uh, with self. And also with self has, uh, in our view, self has uh, a little bit of uh, operational longevity than the seed five. Seed five seem to be like nothing. It's kind of new on the on the scene right now. And uh, self has been uh, has been around for a while. So they have built some kind of credibility over the years too. Thank you so much for your attention. I really appreciate it. In today's conversation, I want to I wanted to quickly talk to you about Seed Five Credit Builder Loan. So we spoke about the credit, the line of credit, but also the the loan products. Okay, fantastic. So I give you the overview, the target, the approach, the review, the eligibility, the application, and all, um, what the rivals are saying, what the rivals like you know are saying ver versus Seed Five. Thank you. God bless you. I'll speak to you another time. But until then, remember, stay marvelous.